So the cross trainer or elliptical trainer. This one here, Ash is just gonna step onto it now. With this, your hands and your feet move in conjunction with each other. So as you're pushing forward on your left hand, your right foot pushing forward. What this is doing is almost creating a scissor effect. To use this machine, simply just get started, get moving, and then you've got to press go on the LCD display. Once you press go, that'll then start putting more resistance on as you press the level up, or taking the resistance down as you press the level down. So for this process, we're gonna put the level up, and she's gonna put them on the fixed handles. You've also got levels on the LCD display as well. So what this is doing now is this is making it harder for her to actually walk. So something I want you to note here, and this is the hand position. So if she holds the moving handles, she can utilize her arms as well. So because you're moving two body parts, you are effectively gonna burn more calories than using just your feet alone. And as your legs start to get tired, your arms can sort of take over. So it does really help being able to use your arms and your legs because as one body part gets tired, the other one takes over. But you can also leave go of them moving handles and hold the fixed handles, which means that it's a legs alone what you're doing it. As you start to tire or as you want to stop, you can just press the level down button, which is on the fixed handles or on the LCD display. And then just press stop on the LCD display now. That's it, workout complete. Just make sure that your feet are completely stopped moving. And once they are, step backwards safely off the cross trainer.